A recent poll shows one in eight Americans over the age of 50 are addicted to highly processed foods. So things like sweets, salty snacks, sugary drinks, even fast food. In today's Your Healthy Family, I'm showing you why a dietitian says this isn't surprising. Processed foods are known to be hyper palatable. So what is a hyper palatable food? It's a food that studies have shown that really kind of hijack areas in the brain. So they'll make you feel great. They'll take away the, the sensation of fullness. So when we look at something that's hyper palatable, it's very hard to stop eating that. Cleveland Clinic registered dietitian Kristen Kirkpatrick says signs of food addiction can include intense cravings, having trouble cutting down on how much you're eating and experiencing withdrawal. Kirkpatrick says there's also no one direct cause for food addiction. It can vary from person to person. For example, someone might be triggered by an event or a person or use food to help cope with their emotions. That's why she says it's important to have a therapist involved in this type of issue. They can help get to the root cause. And from there, a registered dietitian can help pick the right foods to eat. We have studies that look at food addiction and looking at trauma in childhood. We have studies looking at if one or two parents were alcoholics. There was a new study showing that you are more likely to be going into food addiction. So there's a lot of things that are outside of the dietetic world that are more in the mental health world. This is why a therapist is going to be so crucial to work with. Researchers involved in the poll say doctors should ask people about food addictions, which can ultimately help them get the right treatment and improve their overall physical and mental health. For Your Healthy Family, I'm Lisa Greenberg. And for more health stories, head to fox4now.com slash yourhealthyfamily.